What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Party Mother. Act, 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 I figured I'd tap in with y'all because I'm stuck I'm trying to get out, I'm trying to start pulling off here. Um, I'm in the pilot. Uh, the truck's blocking me. But anyway, I want to tap in and talk to you about a subject real quick. <coughs> I get a lot of inboxes from new drivers asking what company you should go to, this and that. I just want to say this, man, like, everybody asking the wrong questions. Nobody's, and what's the scary part? It should be scary to everybody on the road. Nobody's asking the real question, that the question they need to know. Only thing people are concerned about is how much they're going to be paid. There's no concern for what the job entails, how to do the job, how to do the job successfully. Nobody asks these questions. They only ask about how much money you gonna give me, dog. You know, no matter what we gotta do. Like a guy calls me the other, he texts me the other day, hit me up. He says, "Uh, I can't." Uh, turn this shit, don't come down. Oh shit. Thank you, sister. The sister let me get out, man. I asked the sister, can I get out, please? Uh, they got me packed in like a full huge flame. And I decided to cut this video with y'all real quick, so I'm not actually going to cut out. I'm actually going to cut behind her in the fuel island and wait until she gets finished fueling. And then I can get my fuel and proceed on about my way. I got to go pick up a little bit of ice cream today. So. Where she from. She ain't got up but day camp, so. And I ain't in no rush, you know. I got plenty of time. I got to 11.59 and I can pick this up. You know, um, and I'm going now. It's actually uh, 8.54. Uh, I made a mistake. I came home. Every time I feel like I do that, I feel like I made a mistake. Sometimes. My son, he was real aggravated. And he was real agitated. He agitated the shit out of me because he wouldn't stop just crying. He wanted his mama to carry him. 24-7, he gotta be under her foot 24-7, that blew me that blew me, cause we're trying to get some stuff done can't get it done, and he crying and I'm telling her, like, why is he crying and then she like, oh, he's just a little baby and all this little baby shit, and I'm like, you know what take me to my truck cause I like, I, I like, here's my thing see, a lot of mother don't understand what's happening around here see, why y'all don't come and ask the important questions, I'm the one who do when I did it, cause I'm concerned about doing the job right not killing nobody and being successful out here. The money will come. If you take care of what your responsibility as a driver, because I don't think a lot of people know this, when you see people getting on the off-ramp, all the foolish four wheels you see, it's your responsibility to make sure they make it, mother. Because you are the professional. That's why, why you think when we get an accident, they first come to you. You are the professional. A lot of y'all don't ask that. You don't even know because you caught up with the money. You're responsible for every mother out there riding around you. The stuff they don't see, you need to see before they see. That's your job. That's your responsibility. Make sure everybody get home at the end of the day. You're not doing that. You lack it, brother. Money will come. Shut the f up about money. Money will come when you handle your mother business. When you do the job, how the job's supposed to be done. The main thing you should be concerned about your first year truck driver is how to do this successfully. That's it. That's it. The money will come if you do what you need to do. If you're not doing what you need to do, you're not going to get paid. Simple as that, bro. Guy hits me up and he says, man, they want me to remember this speech to say the DOT officer. I think it's kind of stupid. I said, really? You think it's kind of stupid? But all of us remember this, remembered what to say, but you don't think you need to. And not knowing if it's crack bit or bro not knowing what's going on with your vehicle, you think this is stupid. To sit there and have to obtain the knowledge about the vehicle that you'll be driving every motherfucking day, you think it's stupid. A waste of your mother time. But what are you doing, rich guy? Because I show none of you motherfuckers ain't no rich guy because you wouldn't be coming in trying to get some money. That's a fact, okay? 
So do you want to get paid? You want to get some money? Do what you need to do. Be a professional. Handle your business. Don't hit nothing. That's how you get paid. Not coming in and find what company this, what company that, because if you're a good driver, you're going to get paid no matter where you go. You understand that? A lot of y'all don't get that. If you're a good driver, you're going to get the bag no matter where you go. If you're a good driver, because you're going to make sure you get the bag. And you're a hustler. You got to have to hustle by yourself. I cut lots of you. You have to have to hustle by yourself, because this is a hustle. A lot of people think we just be playing around, just BSing. Nah, we get to it out here. If you're going to come out here, your, your main focus, your first year in truck driving, should be how to be a good driver, a good safe driver. That's all you should focus on. That's all you should focus on how to be a good safe driver. I don't want to hear you saying shit about no money until you know how to operate that vehicle properly, until you deliver a load. Because you're only as good as your last load. You deliver 10 million loads, crash on that next 11 million, 11 million and one, you're trash. You're only as good as your last load around here. That's how it works. You do know, 15, 20, 30 years. You're only good as the last bag you drop the fuck off. Okay? Because that was done without a problem. You only as good as that bag. You better remember it. A lot of you don't understand what's going on out here. This is a serious job. You know, a lot of people joke and BS, but nobody really takes into account the seriousness of the job. Because here's the thing: when you're watching people videos, they know what they gotta do. So you out here watching the video, but you don't know shit what you gotta do. But we know exactly what we gotta do. That's why we make videos. But we know what we gotta do. I laugh and joke with y'all, but I'm so tuned in. On and off ramp, people getting on and all that stuff. Cars making food smooth. You gotta be be able to predict what they doing before they actually even do it. You can't. Nobody has time for you to wait. Nobody has time for you to wait and figure out what's being done. You need to figure out what's being done and get it taken care of immediately, expediently. The time is of the essence with this here. See what I'm saying? Time is of the essence. Mm -mm. All these port workers, all these port workers got them up, got their uh, safety vests on. I hear that port workers, the container pullers. I'm not in the container gang, nor do I want to be a part of that raggedy mother. Okay? Pulling the wet boxes. I got some food in my back, some snack cakes and stuff like that. That's what I like to haul. Yesterday I had the wolf. I had a quarter million dollars worth of meat on this motherfucker. And it ain't weighing but 20,000. It wasn't even maxed out at a $40,000 trailer. It wasn't even all the way maxed. It was at 20,000, dog. 20,000, 250,000. Yeah. See, that's what I'm, that's seriousness right there, dog. Quarter of a million dollar bag on your back. 80,000 pounds. About 65, 70,000 pounds. Roller. It's a lot of money on my back. That's, 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 what, that's a lot of stuff at stake. That's a lot of stuff at stake. I got to get that from point A to point B safely. Nobody even thinks about that. There is no consideration going into what you need to do. That's why a lot of you will fail. You will eventually fail because you, you, your focus is all wrong. Your first year truck driving, your focus should be on how to be a good driver, how to be safe, productive, and successful. Support party hard, y'all stay safe and forever stay suck them up the Oh, hold up. I'm about to be able to add some Boom, boom. I'm about to be able to add that for real, yeah. I took, I took, I took it somewhere. Y'all don't got. I took it somewhere, bro. You see it? Yeah. How about that? I'm trying to do some, do some of my videos. That's all. I help my daughter. See you, boy, boy, I still say something.